well, thank you again for joining us back for this further talk. I, um, in our little break here, was fascinated with some of the uh, comments that you made about some of your clients. So without revealing anything about a particular client, I am really fascinated with what you've seen in China when you've had patients come to you or clients come to you, I should say, um, on the types of conditions that you've had great success with using hypnosis. Actually, a lot. Uh, we, um, such as depression, that is very common, very, very common. So like common. the clinical level of depression where people are medicated even? Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. And, okay. and also, we then, can do that yeah. within one session. Within one session? One session? Uh, yeah. Only, I think, only Omni can do this. There's ah. nowhere else that I... Because I they take you so deep into somnambulism, is that why? You yeah, go so deep into trance? If a patient can go to somnambulism or a deep state of hypnosis, a lot of hypnosis can do can mm -hmm. do that, mm -hmm. but they don't know, they may not know what to do, what to do, what to do once they're there. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. It goes back to that. You can train a monkey on how to take somebody into trance. Yeah. 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 What do you do after? Okay. Yeah. And, and most other hypnosis techniques, they, they, they have to take 10 or 30 or 50 sessions to cure us or, or relieve a simple sim symptom. But we, uh, also we think, uh, in Omni, we think depression is just simple matter. We don't think it is a very serious It's not thing. a big thing that you have yeah, to have. Yeah, yeah. You know, I think that's what I appreciate about what I've read in Dave Elman's books, too, is I think Dave's point was people can be cured instantly. Why do they have to drag it out? That's just yeah. a money-making model. Mm -hmm. You should be able to come once, twice, three times, you know. But it's basically this stuff happens quickly. Yeah, you go home and quick. finish the, the healing process. Yeah, but even uh, not only the general public, they don't believe that people can be cured so quickly, but also, people in this profession, other hypnotists besides Omni hypnoti uh, hypnotists, they don't believe in it. Mm -hmm. So this, they will criticize us, and they will curse us, they will say things, bad things to us, saying yeah. that you are doing something impossible, you are advertising that kind of thing. False advertising. And also, they say that, you've that, seen the results. They say that if you can cure or heal depression only one session within an hour, you should get a Nobel, a Nobel Prize. But we, we think a lot of hypnosis really can do it, especially Omni hypnosis. I think there are a lot of other uh, hypnosis, uh, hypnotists can do that too, but I don't, don't think they are, I don't. Uh, I don't there's not gonna be a corporate model behind that yeah. because there's not a long-term money stream. You see a client once or twice and they're done. They don't come back. Yeah, right? I think Omni hypnosis, hypnotists, they can, do this on a regular basis we're very very uh, I don't know because you if you follow the procedure like uh, for example if if it is five uh, five steps one two three four five if you've done all that and everyone every single then uh, you you do it right then the client must be good must, yeah. must be well, cured must be cured must be cured yeah I mean if the symptom is gone that's secure uh, we not don't call that not, not only the symptom because uh, you you use you get the uh, cause like, versus yeah, just the, the, the yeah. cause is gone. You use chemotherapy; it is it is the only cure, cure and the cure symptom, but yeah. it is not a really real cure. True, because mm -hmm. this is why many times people will uh, they call it remission in Western yeah, yeah, medicine. Yeah, yeah. I gave you an intervention; you had a remission; it's mm -hmm. suppressed, but it and can also, come back with a vengeance. I, I think later. in medi uh, in medicine they they think that if the person has a cancer and do something about it within five years they don't come back it yes. is a cure but in hypnosis it is not a cure right because mm -hmm. you haven't gotten down there. so you've seen results with um, like uh, for example allergies allergies is that a pretty simple one yeah very that's simple. a pretty easy uh, actually the founder, kind of like the depression was easy you know Gerald okay. Kine founder of Omni Hypnosis Training Center he can cure allergy uh, I think 15 minutes or 30 minutes Next, next, next. That's and that's it. That's easy. One, one time, and you're one done. Time. Yeah. Wow, that's next fabulous. Time, next time. Uh, I'm gonna come yeah. to China and see you guys. <laughs> uh, you <laughs> I don't have us. allergies, but now I know where to send people. Uh -huh. Because you know that every allergy has a cost. Right. Every single one of them. So in hypnosis, we go back to what we talked about earlier. It's emotional, and so. Allergies basically are an emotional trigger within the immune system? Uh, we don't say whether it's in the immune system, but we say it's an emotional issue. Like if a person has a, 
personality all all his life. Maybe we we do regression to uh, go back in time to find that maybe during college he has a girlfriend, and mm -hmm. when uh, they have a party, they are eating like seafood, and then the girlfriend said to him that I want to break up. That triggered the em emotion. emotion. And that emotion attached to the seafood. To the seafood. That's why that you have all kinds so of. Sense. That's why you can you have all kinds of allergies. Right, mm -hmm. and it can happen whether as an infant you could have had an event at okay. birth that there's just a smell could trigger. And that's why the medicine uh, medical doctors they cannot cure this because they can't they, find the cause. Yeah, there's they not just an organic drugs trigger. to pills to cure the symptom. And That's also psychologists can only use psychology method to, to talk to, to talk. talk to you and try to find the cause. You they may find the cause like when you were one year ago, two years ago, but it may never be like within the womb. Right, mm -hmm. right, right. And yeah. it could be some event that your mother had happen while you were yes. being Yes, And also yeah. uh, since we are talking about the womb, like a, a lot of uh, cancer patients when you find the cause, mm -hmm. they make one into they may go into the womb and see and hear, or may feel that the mother and father are talking about abortion, right? Leukemia, that kind of yeah. thing. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Ask all any, any, and it could be a trauma yeah. the mother experienced, and the baby fully experiences without the left brain yes. doesn't have anything to process that information. Yes, anymore. that uh, because the mother and father wants to have an abortion, and the baby feels that. And the baby will think, well, since my mother and father don't want me, so what can I do? I need to leave. What? Can, how can I leave? I must have a disease. So that's one example. It's not always the cause. Not but always that the cause. Not always the cause. It's very often. Very often. Yes, and so. you get that through regression. It's as if yes, they regression. recall what they heard in you. Yes. yes, and also. Uh, and then it's gone. If you, uh, if you, I think you. If you, if you are a cure, if you you are using hypnosis to cure cancer. It is not that easy to do that within one session. Right. I, uh -huh. It's a it bigger take, field of yeah. trauma. Yeah. And we are not uh, directly dealing with the symptom, the cancer cells. We are dealing especially to the emotional, uh, emotional part. emotions. So yeah. if a client came to you and said, oh, I've got this cancer, and you're thinking, okay, well, we're not going to work on that. We're going to work with you, take you to trance. We'll just take a look. And, and so you're going and clearing emotional layers. So you don't even tell them you're addressing the cancer. Yeah. It's almost as if that disappears as the positive side effect. Uh, yeah, actually, yes, part of, yes. actually, part of the steps are to address the emotional part. And then the other parts may be dealing like uh, some white light to heal the the cells. Hence why you're taking other energy modality techniques no, actually, or uh, informational field techniques, uh -huh. mm -hmm. white light, those types yeah, of things yeah. to bring yeah. in new new energy into the system. Mm -hmm. Yes. Imagination can do that too. Oh, yes. Uh, yeah, in, in hypnosis, we have visualization, so we can, we can use the visualization techniques to, to visualize the light, and that can cure. Also. So do you, as the hypnotherapist, practice the visualization? Do you also have your client? No, the only, the, only, only the, the patient. Only the patient. So you have them go through sending in a healing light yes. to the area. Yes. Oh, that's, that's beautiful. Very, that's very effective. That's very effective. It's almost like turning on a, a healing um, resource within their body mm -hmm. that just stays on, stays on run. How, have you ever done anything with uh, autoimmune disorders, which is an immune system in overactive? It's an you know, immune system that's reacting inappropriately to stimuli. In the environment, does the spine thing? Um, I, uh, so there are theories, for example, like fibromyalgia, which is pain all over the body, mm -hmm. is an inflammation response. It's probably an autoimmune disease um, where the immune system can't yeah, figure out what to attack, and it just begins to generally attack the body. No matter what the symptoms are, we we use the same protocol. Find the cause and fix find it. That Same is, thing with diabetes, then, which was has been classified yeah, as an everything, autoimmune. Everything. Because everything. 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 it's really the body working what it thinks is intelligent, but not working in tune with what it needs to do in the body. It's still displaying this disease state. And there must because be a something reason. That's gone there arrive. must be a reason. a reason. So the reason we need to find it through regression. Through regression. No, but there are some other hypnosis trainings that 
say if, uh, regression is dangerous. Dangerous. So they ask the students to not do regression. I think really? that is mainly that. because they don't know how to do the correct way. The correct way. So without you having to go through all that, because I know that's part of your training, and we and again we don't want to. But my what I hear when I hear the word regression, it's really the idea of having them. You're at. Are you asking them questions that help them back up to when, mm -hmm. in their unconscious level, as you're talking to the subconscious mind, it says, yeah, this is where it sprang from. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. So they're just simply they're so, doing with you a process where they actually walk back it's and say, just like this, this. Just like this. You are in hypnosis. And I ask you, right now you, you are in your kindergarten, so you are in kindergarten, so what's happening? So you will tell me. Huh? And the yeah. patient is, the client is always aware. Always aware. Mm -hmm. I have not, been hypnotized and I know I've heard everything that's going on. Yes, yes. Just in this calm. It is just like meditation. Yes, I just want to, I want to go there. It's very relaxing. Yeah. So I can see why even just learning how to go into that state, you know, I think people get afraid of the word trance. Trance doesn't mean I'm out of control. It means I'm in a very relaxed state. Mm -hmm. yeah. I've taken off all stress response. Basically, the left faculty, that left brain we talked about, mm -hmm. as if it's truly divided, is just quiet. There's no judgmental voice. I will tell my students, uh, I will tell my clients that you are just talking with your eyes closed. Yes. This yes. is exactly that. that. When the conscious mind is out of the way, the subconscious can do its work. It can. Mm -hmm. It can get in there and, and do the repair work. Yeah. Right. What's the, uh, have you got a, an example of a story of somebody that came in that just didn't think they could, but they'd heard about you, and they're like, yeah, I, I'm willing to give this a try. Yeah. I and think the spine, spine problem. Yeah, talking, be, yeah, yeah, tell me about the spine problem, because now that we're talking structure, I mean, I can get that tissues can grow, and they can shrink. You hear stories like instant remission all the time. I don't know how to Spinal put stenosis? Yeah, so, uh, yeah. And I, um, as I understand it, you looked up, it's a... Uh, it's where you get all of that crunchiness down in the lower area of the back and it can spread on up through and they lose mobility and it's very, very painful. Oh, very, 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 painful. very painful. You've actually seen that change with yeah, your Yeah, actually. Uh, I was, this year, uh, at the last year, at the end of last year, yeah. there, is a, there was a woman who contacted us and she says that she, she has this illness and it is not curable and because he, she has tried in many hospitals and done many tests in her body and they offered to do surgeries on her and she has already done two surgeries I think and no no, use. no, you, no relief no relief and it, it has already been like 18 years I think oh and every time day she that. lived in agony and it's like oh, a, yes. you you don't know how, how that feels. Uh, every night, actually, she feels so much pain that when when she goes to the surgery, it doesn't need she doesn't any, need any anesthesia because the pain, the knife's cutting her. We're not as painful not as, as painful. the condition itself. Yes. Yeah. Wow. So that's how painful it is. So she every night, she uh, when she wants to, wanted to sleep, she will uh, do this, for one minute and then do this for one minute. Oh wow. Nothing else. So actually she could not fall asleep. She couldn't actually sleep, which yeah. is also bad for the entire mm -hmm. nervous system. And everything where she goes, she has to be accompanied by her by her family. And wow. yeah, everywhere. So tell me a little bit about what you did. So you took um, her to <clears throat> a rapid she induction. Contacted us not about the induction. Uh, when I uh, talked to her, I don't uh, actually at that time. I didn't think that I was able to help her. Yeah, was it a new I, case? Yeah, yes, it, it is. It was a new case, and uh, she came because it, actually she she doesn't have any money. Yeah, she it's, didn't. She it's contacted it's, us for I'm begging sure us to working, help her. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And, it, and it is all for free. Oh, that was nice. But uh, back then, just as I was, was saying, that I didn't know if I would be able to help her. But she contacted us so many times and begged us. And I thought, if not me, then who? Then who? If, not, if not now, then when? So oh. it, just go for it. 
Yeah. And I uh, I think that is within three sessions. Three sessions. Three consecutive, consecutive days. days. Consecutive. So three days in a row. Yeah, three, three, three sessions. sessions. One session, maybe 12 hours. Uh, two hours or less. Two hours. Mm -hmm. And I think. Wow. And I think uh, I didn't do anything particular about the spine. I just find the cause in the the emotional deal with, issues. Yes, deal with the uh, emotional issues. That happen to show up yes. in the spine. Um, not not, I, not I actually, uh, when we uh, cure those diseases, we don't think about the physical body at all. We just okay. think just about the in. emotional issues. So we just solve the emotional mm -hmm. issues. And there are a lot of anger, a lot hatred. of resentment, hatred, everything. And release that and positive suggestions. And that, it worked. It worked. And, so, and also after that, because he, uh, she went back the following day, she took a train to uh, to Beijing, and then uh, her, her father, uh, no, her husband was with her because she could not walk by herself, not very easily. And right. she, when she went back her, to her hometown, everybody was shocked because they said that she, she looked was, taller. Yes, she, she was tall. Oh, I'm sure she was. Taller. Because she was like this. She had to do this, yeah. Every and now she, she can walked, stand. And then she can do this. So. <laughs> Everybody, everybody will. Everybody will say that to her. So did she need more than three, or at three? Only, three, yeah, only three. Only three. Only three. And was she at zero pain after yes, three? Yes, right now. It is zero. Zero. Even till now. Even till now. Mm -hmm. uh, what a transformation for her life as well. And also, not, not only that, yeah. he didn't have any money before. Right now, he she has already become an omni. Hypnotist. Oh, that's Hypnotist. wonderful. She's curing you diseases. She, she's curing and depression. And people actually all around China, the people in South, because she lived in south uh, in the North, and people in the South are uh, paying for the plane tickets. To, just uh, to go to her. Uh, uh, yeah, well, no, she's... just like to uh, fly to the South to cure, to do to the help hypnosis. Them. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, she's a living testimony, right? She's experiencing yes, yeah. it. Do you find that what you... Well, let me ask that. Uh, we're going to reserve that for the next interview because I would like to do a whole topic around the mental state of the hypnotist mm -hmm. and how that affects it. Okay. Thank you for sharing this. This is wonderful. Appreciate your time.